Mr. Can here again, and I'm in my creative world. I've been playing around with the texture pack a bit, as you can see the glass looks slightly different here. Which I, I, you know, I, I quite like that. May obstruct the view, but uh, I think it's worth it. And uh, the half slabs here as well, yeah, so I've been playing with them. Not sure I'm particularly fond, the colour seems a bit off. I mean, if I change the overall stone, it may suit. I don't know. We'll have to have to see, really. Oh, yes, and I added a slight difference on the half on the uh, stone bricks. Anyway, main reason I'm making a video: I want to create a harbour, and I thought, you know, I'll record my process. Oh, yes, reflections. There you go. Reflected glass. How fun! It's not too great at night, but looks rather nice during the day. I can hear what sounds like a mouse. I do hope that's not. Anyway, let's continue. I want to create a harbour, as I say. This uh, area is swamp here. So if I, if I was to create it here, I'd have to take the ground out. So it's lower, deeper, technically. Or extend the land. Is that squeaky one? Anyway, extend the land out to a deeper area of water, like here. But that means, what do I do with all of that? I don't know. Lakeside town, maybe? Any who's? Oh, quickly while we're on a video, I'll uh, just show you the bridge I was working on, the other side of the cathedral. Wasn't shown in the previous video. Mostly because it wasn't built. <laughs> but yeah. Here's the bridge leading up to it. Nothing special at the moment, really. I need to add some detail, but giant, giant bridge. Wait for the world to load. That's the reflective model there. It takes uh, takes a while. The reflective shader on. I can take it off, I guess. But I, I quite like it. Yeah, so also changed my gravel. Look, bones. Anyway, area over here on the other side of the bridge. Gonna create a castle up here, I believe. On top of all this land. This is a, a cross section over from 1.7 to 1.8 land generation, so it looks a bit odd. But obviously if the castle's on top of this, covering over that as well, because that is just ugly. But yeah, follow along the terrain here, maybe along the water follow the river across, kind of like a moat, build something on this area, gradually slope it down with some sand or gravel, so it's similar to, to this area here, where my mouse cursor is. Uh, yeah, so there's the bridge. But yeah, anyway, to, do, to decide what area I want to build the harbour in, there's a, a neat tool I like to use, it's called Mind Mapper. I haven't got the updated version yet, but uh, I'll show you yeah, I'm not sure if there is an updated version. Hang on. Uh, I'll just pause the recording here and jump into Mind Mapper. Uh, yeah, it was just a quick video there to say that I'm planning on building the harbour. And uh, I'm going to record the process, upload it as I go. It won't be a time lapse or anything like that because I haven't got a, a second account. But uh, I will up upload the progress of me building it. I might record as I'm building, see how that goes. My commentary is a bit, you know, not <laughs> it's not very good. Pumpkins! Smiley pumpkins. Halloween coming up soon. I'll definitely have to buy myself a pumpkin. Anyway, let's move over to this area where where the harbour will be. If any of you uh, have seen any of my, my work before with ships. I actually I actually enjoy building big big battleships as I did on a, a previous server I, I played on. Uh, I won't name the server as uh, I'm not sure what their capacity is like right now but it was a fun fun playing on there while it lasted. Uh, things went wrong, PvP, you know. Anyway, someone burned down my ship. It wasn't very nice. Here, I mean it seems like a perfect area because 
yes, it might be all flat, but... Oh, 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 see this? This here is bad. This is the problem you get with the area. It might be hard to see with the reflective shader, but the ground, uh, the water level here is there, where I place that wooden block. Whereas, in this area, it's one higher. Ah, you can, there you go. Massive problem there. Well, not really massive. I could, uh, I could build a cross here. Ah, yeah, see? So there we go, perfect. I can build across that. Harbour starts on top. There's no water there. Yeah, no, okay, that works fine. I'll just have to prettify the edge. Yes, I just said prettify. Anyway, this video is getting, getting slightly long, so I'm going to say goodbye for now. And I will see you in the next video, where I will start to create the foundation for the dock. Okay, so as you may or may not have noticed, the previous attempt at showing this was a complete fail. So here we are again, uh, in my mapper, and we'll open up the world. Flat world. What a name. And, okay. So, as you see, green, top of the bridge. That's the half bricks. Not the half bricks, what am I on about? Well, they are slabs, I guess, uh, but the, the stone bricks. And a partly created cathedral. Where is the roof, you ask? Well, it's there, it's it's just not being drawn. So anyway, the, the area I initially wanted to build the harbour in was here. You can see a nice expanse of water. However, the new area is over here. Because, as you can see, well, it looks like an ocean biome. If that is such a thing. So, yes, it's a lot of work, I guess. I'll have to try and ignore the giant TNT canyon I've created. Resources were hard to come by. <laughs> um, yeah, so I, I could build city in, in, in this area, building to the harbour. It's going to be quite quite a large area if I'm trying to cover cover all of this ugly transition. I mean, I know a lot of people go into MC Edit and they, they delete the old chunks and, you know, it's, it's really not going to work that well because a lot of a lot of the build, actually, in fact, all of the building I've done so far has been on the old 1.7 world and so it's, it's going to create more hassle, I think, than it's worth. So I, I will just, just do this manually by hand. Uh, but don't worry, I won't, I won't record myself doing all I might and I'll speed it up, actually, I can show people how how good good ways of smoothing off edges I guess if I can do it myself that is anyway yes that's uh, that's my mapper and it's a day day view night view uh, there we go shows all the lights it's quite nice uh, cave view that'll also show like internally in buildings as well because there's this cathedral's here, my shops, part of the bridge, <laughs> which is hollow. But yeah, there's a mine shaft system. There's what appears to be spawner, spawner, spawner. As green as is mossy cobble. So yeah, so I suppose you could use it for cheating, but uh, yeah, no, it's it's I've, I've not really used the cave cave views before. I quite like the the day view though, it's very useful for viewing your map overall that is, and you can change the maximum height level and maybe down to 75 if that doesn't crash, no, there we go oh, would you look at that, cathedral floor, how pretty yeah, so I'll, I'll say goodbye on that, bye bye testing, testing, one, two, three